My questions during this interview may not be that powerful, so I'm here with an expert to learn how to ask powerful questions. <laughs> That's awesome. I, I'm glad to be here, and I'm looking forward to uh, telling some uh, good tips about how to ask powerful questions. What's the root of asking a powerful question? The root of asking a powerful question is uh, navigating via curiosity. So uh, curiosity is something that um, I think too many of us probably shy away from. I think, uh, you know, when I think of curiosity, I think about killing the cat. And that's kind of a dangerous thing for people. So uh, for me, curiosity is the root of it because it says that you have a genuine interest in what people are trying to say and that you're not necessarily going to cut them off at the first thing they say. You want to be curious and find out more uh, and not assume that just because they've stopped speaking that they've said the whole story. So listening is just as important as asking the question. What do you do after you've asked the question? You listen. So after you've asked the question. So asking powerful questions, first of all, and they're not complicated questions, by the way. So powerful questions can be simple questions. Powerful questions are things that uh, cause somebody to think. So you asked a powerful question, and now the person is going to answer it. And so what you want to do is absorb yourself completely in what the person is saying. Turn off your mind. Don't think about anything. Just follow their words and everything that they're saying really closely. And when they pause and when they stop, uh, it's another chance to get curious and ask the next powerful question. So to, um, to have them speak and feel heard, and if you don't have another question to ask after they've stopped speaking, you can also just repeat back to them what they've said, and then you'll have another question to ask. Okay, well you're doing two sessions at the conference here today, one on leadership and one on asking powerful questions. How do those two things intertwine? Uh, so I think Asking powerful questions is one of the greatest skills of what I would call legendary leaders. And legendary leaders, I think as you uh, approach leadership and you um, rise up in your career, uh, it actually becomes less about speaking and more about asking. So learning to ask powerful questions as you become a leader is uh, probably the great, one of the greatest skills uh, that will propel you into that role. Well, thank you so much, Mary. This has been insightful, and thank you to everyone watching.